Well, it looks like Austin has wiped out its projected budget shortfall. This morning, the city council got its first look at the city's proposed budget, and it was better than many had expected. KXAN City reporter Reagan Hackleman is here live in the studio with us with a closer look at the numbers. Well, Leslie, if you've ever wondered what a $2.8 billion budget looks like, this is what it looks like. Now it is the job of city council members and their staff to go through this budget, uh, through this budget and find out exactly what they want to keep. Now, most of the budget will stay the same when it's approved in September. Now it's up to city council to determine how much you'll pay in property taxes. As it stands right now, the proposed budget would increase property taxes by 1.9% over last year's tax rate for the medium home in Austin worth $184,000. That 1.9% increase will cost you a little more than four bucks a month. Now, if approved, that increase would help pay for 48 more police officers, 30 more paramedics, and 10 more firefighters. Austin Police Union was hoping the city would add more officers, but they're happy with they're happy with what they got. I think what you're going to see is they're going to fill in the holes that are there. It's not going to get us uh, uh, over the hump, but uh, it's, it's going to keep us from going into critical manpower shortages, which we had last year. Now, Austin's library will also get some extra money. $500,000 is in the budget for new materials. Next up to public hearings in late August, council is scheduled to approve the budget on September 13th. If you actually want to go through this entire 1,500-page budget, you can find it on our website. That's KXAN.com. Search for this story under local news. Live in the studio, Reagan Hackleman, KXAN Austin News.